Yo, what's up? Welcome to week five for our eight week fitness challenge. Today, I want to talk to you about my obsession with working out and how it's become an important part of our journey to becoming great. This is going to be a great topic today, just talking about the mindset of doing a challenge like this. I've always been driven to succeed and be the best version that I can be. And for me, that means constantly pushing myself to improve both physically and mentally. Working out has become a key part of that pursuit. I started going to the gym regularly and trying to figure out different workouts and fitness routines. At first, it was just to say that I wanted to be in shape and improve my health. But as I continued to push myself and see progress, I became more and more passionate about working out. For those who don't know, when I was younger, I used to work out specifically for the benefits of basketball, just becoming a better athlete for the sport in itself. But now that process has evolved into something more greater. Now, working out is a daily ritual for me. I love the feeling of pushing myself to the limit and seeing what my body is capable of. I've tried a variety of workouts from high intensity interval training to weightlifting and yoga, and I found that I enjoy them all. But on today's topic, we're talking about how weightlifting is strengthening the body, the mind, the spirit, and just having that connection. So my obsession with working out isn't just about the physical benefits. It's, it's also had a positive impact on my mental health. Exercise has been shown to improve focus and concentration, which is crucial for achieving greatness. Plus, the endorphins that are released during the exercise give me a natural boost of confidence and motivation. And as you can see, this will carry over into any aspect of your life. So I highly recommend anyone who's looking to get into fitness. We have a new year coming up. Maybe you have some New Year's resolutions with health and wellness that you're trying to hit and just see a better version of yourself there's not a better time to get started than right now however my pursuit of greatness hasn't been without its challenges it's easy to become too focused on one aspect of your life and neglect others i'm sure we all can relate to that whether that's work relationships families all these are factors that can take you off your mindset and your goals of staying locked into the gym I've had to learn to strike a balance and make sure that I'm still taking care of my mental health and spending time with my loved ones. It's also important to be flexible and adaptable. Sometimes the best path to greatness is not the one you originally planned. In addition to my obsession with working out, I've also made it a priority to continually learn and grow. I read books, listen to podcasts, and attend seminars and workshops to stay up to date with the latest information and strategies in this field of working out. Every day is an opportunity to get better, smarter, to receive information. You never stop learning, you never stop studying. There's always something new to gain and add to your own recollection of knowledge. I believe that true greatness comes from a combination of hard work and dedication and a willingness to learn and adapt, not only for yourself, but also to be able to source of knowledge to help others. So when you combine the relentless pursuit and the obsession with working out, that is a powerful combination. Working out has helped me to improve my physical and my mental health and my ongoing commitment to learning and growth has opened me up to new opportunities and experiences. I'm grateful for the journey. I'm glad to be back on this journey that I've been on and I encourage others to pursue their own path to greatness. Last thing I wanna leave you with is to remember that it's important to have discipline because it helps us maintain control over our lives and achieve our goals. Without discipline in this process, we can easily be swayed, distracted, have impulses and temptations that prevent us from reaching our full potential. In this case, it's just hitting our goals. We can have days where we have inspiration as a motivator and that can help us overcome challenges and achieve great things. However, inspiration alone is not enough to achieve lasting success. It is often fleeting and can fade over time, leaving us feeling lost and directionless. That is why discipline is better than inspiration. Discipline provides us with structure, consistency that we need to stay focused and on track, even when we don't feel particularly inspired. It allows us to take consistent action, even though we don't feel like it, which is key to achieving our goals and reaching our full potential. Discipline is the foundation upon which inspiration can thrive. Without the discipline, inspiration may be fleeting and difficult to sustain, but with discipline, we can turn our inspiration into lasting achievements and success. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. I'll see you in the next video. Let's get after it. Bye -bye.